Two great scientists of their time once performed a strange experiment which made the whole Navy crew teleported to a different world. Along with the teleportation, the machine also made the whole Navy ship invisible. The Philadelphia experiment is one of the strangest military urban legends ever, and it has endured as an infamous World War II conspiracy theory. But is there any truth to it? Before we get to know, give a thumbs up to this video and don't forget to subscribe to this channel. The Philadelphia experiment is the biggest mystery of all the time, which revolves around what is known as the Montauk Project. It's a complicated saga which is filled with tales of mind control, time travel, government cover-ups, secret experiments and much more. And it's all focused around a certain facility located on Long Island, New York. It's a story that has its origins in the 1940s and an incredible series of classified programs run by the US Navy but which didn't start it to surface publicly until the 1950s. It was in 1955 that a highly controversial book on flying saucers was published. The author was Morris Ketchum Jessup and the title of his book was The Case for the UFO. It wasn't long after the book was published that Jessup was contacted by a man who wrote Jessup a number of letters that detailed something astounding. The man was Juan Carlos Allende, a resident of Pennsylvania. Allende provided Jessup what he claimed were top-secret snippets of the experiments performed during World War. It was the time period of the World War II and governments were trying to develop weapons that could help them win the war and US was one among them and the US military together with some of the top scientific minds in the world, men like Nikola Tesla and Albert Einstein, had been working on a new technology which would make their ships invisible. It was October 1943 when the US military decided to test the clocking device and USS Eldridge, number DE-173 was chosen for it. The experiment started in night, the equipment was activated and suddenly a bluish green fog began to surround the Eldridge and in a flash of light, the ship was gone, disappearing into thin air. A short time later, the Eldridge unexpectedly reappeared over 200 miles away in Norfolk, Virginia. Then as suddenly as the Eldridge had appeared, it vanished again before miraculously reappearing back in Philadelphia. Most incredibly, whatever has happened on its journey, the Eldridge appeared to have actually travelled 10 minutes back in time. Scientists and military personnel in Philadelphia rushed to the ship in a mad scramble to ascertain what had happened. What they found were scenes of unimaginable horror. Crew members covered in terrible bones, some actively engulfed in flames, others had gone insane, screaming and rambling incoherently. Most disturbingly, some crew members had actually become embedded in the steel hull of the ship, fused, still alive, with body parts sticking out. Many of them had gone completely and utterly insane and lived out the rest of their lives in asylums for the insane. Some vanished from view and were never seen nor heard from again. No doubt this whole story is incredible, but is it really true? Yesterday I found something on the internet. If you google this, you may see multiple articles related to a patent of a teleportation device. So is it really possible that we already have the teleportation technology? What's your views on all this? Do let us know in the comment section. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.